Welcome, welcome. Sandra Alexa here from um, Game Changer and my personal muse. Now, Game Changer, I'm uh, one of the co-authors. It is a, a book on the new model of relationships, very Aquarian. If you'd like to order it, you can just go to the top and you can see where you can get it from Amazon. The next is if you go below on the show me section, you'll see my website, my personal muse. And I'm a business and spiritual coach. I've also been the author to other books. Um, and so I'm there to be able to assist you with more of the self-discovery. I do astrology, numerology. I do uh, galactic signatures, a lot of different things. So it's about self-discovery. And everybody's gone through such a, a trying time these last couple of years. And there's been lots of changes in your life. Okay, and what is 2022 going to be like for you? Okay, so first of all, I want to thank you for taking the time to listen to the message I have for you. And then I would really appreciate it if you would comment. If you, if you comment, you actually um, get your name in a draw, and I do a free mini reading for someone once a month. Um, so I'd really appreciate it if you would share and totally would appreciate it if you would subscribe to the channel. And that way you get notification of when the new video is going to be up. So I have to say we just experienced the February um, the 2 to 2022. And it was very powerful. There's a lot of, of shifts in the universe right now. A lot of solar flares. Everything's happening. The ascension process. We're moving into the fifth dimension. Some are, so lots going on. So there's a lot of jittery molecules happening. So it's about staying grounded, but I have some really good news for you. And this is what we're going to experience the new moon. So, wow, we're actually upgrading. So I'm very ex excited about this outstanding, beautiful, powerful, and auspicious new moon at 12 degrees of Pisces on March. Um, the 2nd, 2022. So we have more twos. Things are speeding up. Why am I so happy? Because with this new moon and other cosmic energies that are dancing, we can finally look forward with hope to changes. Divine opportunities, personal opportunities, luck, abundance, personal development, new energies, business opportunities, and expansion of consciousness, which all of this is about, the waking up process. It is your time to focus with clarity, skillfully and consciously navigating your life journey. You're the captain of your life. So the bottom line is it's now to stop the confusion and like this is going to happen and that pull yourself away from all the social media type of thing. You know what's going on. Keep abreast of what's going on, but start going back to, to you. Very intense energies as we are experiencing the ascension process. Okay. Um, so you could have lots of physical challenges. So now as I call all of us way showers, we are the be here and anchor the light. The magical spiritual theme is about co-creating new intentions and planting seeds. Aligning with the divine source and being of spiritual service to self and others. Okay, that's our theme. New moons are all about new beginnings. And when we have new beginnings, we have endings. Okay, so your soul knows your contracts, the law of allowing. There's no fixing or, or rescuing anybody. That's codependency. And we're now more into the interdependency, more of the Aquarian energy. You can listen to people, you can show them the way, but it's like a baby has to learn to walk on itself, by itself. We are preparing for March 5th when the sun conjuncts Jupiter. There's a major expansion. And then on, on that's March 5th, then March 6th, Venus and Mars enter Aquarius. I'll do a new video on that. 
Find out where Pisces falls in your natal chart as to where you are to create your new conscious intentions with the super expansive energies. A time to dream big. And I'm a very pragmatic person, but this is a time to dream, dream big, to, to get focused, though, not be, I'm not sure, okay? It's about sovereignty, authenticity, personal boundaries, personal power, truth, and freedom. You are the creator of your universe, and we are building up to a fabulous transit in April of 2022 and to the big event on May the 10th. So there's hope. Okay, it's so a time to set your intentions and goals with tremendous focus, and that's self-mastery. Now, the Pisces-Virgo aspect is about healing and moving from codependency to interdependency. We're being asked to clarify, to focus, and prepare for when the sun moves into Aries on March 20th. And we celebrate the northern and southern equinoxes as that date is the actual new year for astrology. Just like Chinese have their new year, astrology has their new year, and it begins with, with Aries, okay? So we have had a chance to finish up the Pisces-Virgo axis energy. And those were the toughest lessons for how we embrace our personal power, not to give away our personal power, embrace self-mastery, and embrace your, your dharma, your soul purpose, and your mission. It's great for spirituality. However, what the challenges could have been is it can involve addiction. So there's a lot have gone on a booze cruise or an eating binge or a spending binge. There's many types of addictions, okay? An illusion. Oh, yeah, you know, and codependency. Check out the courses and classes I'll be hosting so you are more empowered to understand the planetary cycles. Many blessings. Much love is a great time to have a private session of reading and let me assist you at looking at your planetary shifts, your nodal access for any understanding and answers during these challenging times. Thank you again for taking the time um, to listen to the message. I'd surely appreciate it if you would like, comment, share, and subscribe. Okay, and again, the book is there for you. Now, take the time, because uh, the biggest thing is, like, it's about relationships. Everybody want to know thyself and to thyself be true. Okay, and the first relationship you have is with yourself and with the divine or source and a one. Many blessings, much love, and uh, take care.